I'm doing a review on the Hoover Wind Tunnel High Performance Vacuum. I've had one of these for years, and what they've done is they've re-engineered it, redesigned it, got rid of the flaws, because if you go and look this vacuum up, you're not going to see a lot of reviews, and the reviews that you see are going to talk about the engine overheating, uh, plastic parts breaking, the hose not long enough, all of these problems. Guys, let me tell you what happened really quick. Hoover, years back, had what was called the Hoover Wind Tunnel 3. It was probably the best vacuum that they ever made. And everyone loved it, but they redesigned it. And as they redesigned it, they had nothing but problems. That's what you're reading the reviews on. This vacuum that's sold at Walmart, sold on Amazon, has been, again, totally redesigned. They've put the bigger engine back into it. It says that it has the Hoover Wind Tunnel 3 technology, meaning this is just a clone of their award-winning vacuum that they had years ago. Now, with the Hoover 3 Wind Tunnel 3 technology, one of the things that you're going to notice that I absolutely love is the hose on it. It looks like a regular hose, does it not? Listen, listen, listen. It does, but watch hose, this. Because of the way it's made, can go 15 feet. It can go all the way to the ceiling. Look at this. I'm not kidding around when I say that. It's 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 amazing, and yet it's coiled so it doesn't look like it's all stretched out. I've had vacuums where they wanted to give you a hose, but it looked all stretched out. This one does not, but I can stretch this across the entire living room floor. I can put the attachment on it. I can put it up in the corners. I can get it up where there's cobwebs. I can get into those super small spaces. The thing I like is when you're putting the hose back, which is easy, it just goes around this clip here and then it slides in here, it clips in. Uh, some of the cheaper vacuums, they don't put this mechanism here. And so guess what? From time to time, your hose just slips out or you have to really push your hose in really, really hard, which is stupid. The thing I really like is it gives you the multi-purpose pet tool, which is this. There's a lot of them out there. A lot of your vacuums from about a hundred bucks up comes. You can see the little paw there. Uh, this is made of rubber right here and the reason you want that is that's what's going to get the hair up but it also gets feathers up and it also does a good job on dirt using it on cloth furniture it does an awesome job of kind of revitalizing it and making it look new while sucking all the dust out of it um the mechanism in here you can see the belt there that's just not a flat belt that has the little grooves on it which is a big deal so it's not going to get clogged up when you're really pressing down on particular it. unit has a four level height adjustment. Uh, most of the time I have mine on low and medium. It does an awesome job, okay, on hard floors. Down here it has the HEPA filter, which is for dander. You would not believe how much dust and dander you get in your carpet, even if you don't have an animal. And here's the thing, you just pull this out and there you go. You replace this every six months to a year, depending on the area that you live. If you live in a place that's very, very dusty, you can't live without this. It literally is a deal breaker not having it, but they put it here and it's very inexpensive to replace that piece. Also, it comes with a nether filter. Here you go. You this one is rinsable. Take it out, rinse it, dry it out. Not a problem. This particular one on the bottom, is not, but the reason it's not is because it's activated carbon. That is going to take uh, particles down to 0 0.3 microns, which is a big deal. If you have allergies, if you sneeze, if you have any kind of sinus problem, you have a cold, this vacuum will help you to feel better within a couple days of you vacuuming. You would not believe the difference of what this vacuum can pull up out of the ground because of the larger engine, the technology, which is from the Hoover Wind Tunnel 3, and the redesigned head that is basically the head of the what? Wind Tunnel 3. They put all of the winning components of that original vacuum back into this unit for your pleasure. When this filter is starting to get to a place where it's not allowing the machine to run at capacity, this indicator light will turn red. That means, hey, take it out, rinse it out, you're ready to go. We have the larger wheels on this that are free rolling. It's very easy depending 
on how old you are, small you are, strong you are. It doesn't matter. This vacuum rolls very, very easy. When we go up to the side of it, what we're going to see is another attachment. Again, this can be used for anything. A lot of people use this in cars or they use this on carpets. They use it on their upholstery. It's really going to allow you to scrub back and forth if your animal uh, did what he wasn't supposed to do on the carpet. I love the handle on this. It's in a circle, it's very easy to hold, and on top of the handle is a button. I'm no longer going down here and searching for a red button that flicks up and off. <laughs> okay, now I come here, and there is your button. It's very easy, I just push one in, and she starts you up. You can actually say the handle is very usable, aerodynamic. Let's go back down to the bottom. I wanna tilt this so I can start vacuuming. All I have to do is put my foot here. Again, I'm just pushing this and it releases the mechanism and the vacuum will fall back into your arms. It has a five year warranty. Hoover's been around for over a hundred years. They have the best customer service, even though they made mistakes a couple years back with some of the vacuums that they made. Uh, those mistakes have been clarified. They've, uh, you know, basically paid for their sins. They even have this. If anything's wrong, they say, do not return this vacuum. Call us. We will make the wrongs right. And again, when you're dealing with a company that's been around for 100 years, their name is everything. And so if you have any problems at all, you just call them and they will take care of it. So from the engine, from the redesign, from the larger capacity tank to 13 cyclones that have been again redesigned to what give you more power more suction two different filters uh the cord is long enough to go across my entire house um you're like well matt does it have a rewindable cord it does not I found over time that the spring in the mechanism of the retractable cord starts to give and it just doesn't have the same power to pull in the cord as it did on day one. I actually prefer this, and this is a very, very, very long cord, meaning I can go from this living room into the entire house. That's how long this cord is. So I can go plug it in the living room, vacuum in here, go into the kid's bedroom, go into my bedroom, and the cord is long enough. I don't have to go around the whole house. And again, when you're looking at cheaper vacuums, they're always gonna have what? Shorter cords. Why is that? They're trying to save money. Early on, again, let me specify, when they were between this model and the Wind Tunnel 3 model, they came out with a loser. They shortened the cord, they put a smaller engine in it, they gave you less attachments. And here's the thing, it was a nightmare and they paid a terrible price, especially with uh, reviews and PR. Guys, I vacuumed yesterday on purpose because I knew I was gonna buy this vacuum today and I used a smaller Hoover that I had. I'm gonna go ahead and show you what this can do after vacuuming just yesterday and we'll see. Honestly, one through 10, I give it a nine, a literal strong, strong nine, if not a 10. But, you know, there's a couple things they could have added into it, but I'm very happy with this. I just vacuumed yesterday the entire house with about a four month old vacuum, which was Hoover. It was a smaller version and it has done wonderfully. But this is probably 10 times that vacuum. Guys, let me show you how easy it is to empty this and look at all the stuff that we got in there. That just shows you, and the carpet was just done. We just bring it over here, open it up, give it a shake, and look in there. 
all that, all that was in my carpet and I just vacuumed. That shows you the quality and the power of the suction and the engine and the new rollers. I mean, I'm loving this vacuum. It's very easy to put this back on. It just clips back on. I put the cord back on there and I'm ready for storage. Now guys, this unit, depending on where you buy it, is going to be marketed differently. It could have different accessories. It could be a different color. Basically, it is the same unit, same technology, same engine, same brushes, same everything. Again, if you're getting the exclusive pet version of this, it's the exact same vacuum, although they do have extra attachments. And so if you're buying it at Walmart, it's going to look like this. Or if you're buying it on Amazon, if you're buying it at Target, it could be a different color. They have a swivel version of this that just basically the head swivels. But again, when we're looking at the technology, how it's going to vacuum, how it's going to get the hair up, it's all marketing. It literally is the Wind Tunnel 3 redesigned, recolored up. And the reason you might notice on the pet that this portion right here is red, that's because of all the hair and all the dander. They don't want you seeing that where this is for a typical home. But again, it has the same bristles, has the same engine, has the same everything. This vacuum isn't exclusively marketed towards pets. But even on the box, it says perfect for pets. You know why it says that? Because it has the bigger engine and it has the 15-inch swath when you're running it through the carpet. This particular redesigned unit has 13 cyclones and they say it will not clog up. Guys, I don't care what they say. I've had 15 different vacuums in the last three, four years. I love vacuums, okay? They all eventually clog up if you don't take care of them. But the more cyclones that you have, and that cyclones are what we're talking about here. This one has 13. Uh, the best vacuums out there only have 15. And so 13 is going to give you lots of suction power, okay? And it's gonna get the dirt up along with the 15 inch swath brush spinning with that engine it's gonna clean like you've never had anything clean it has a larger capacity canister and this is a huge deal because the larger the canister the more dirt the more debris the more yuck it can hold but it's not being sucked up and getting clogged up guys this vacuum sells for under two hundred dollars and the reason that's amazing is because the wind tunnel three was every bit of $300 if a person was able to get one of those back in the day. And many people have them and they just love them. But when you compare the Wind Tunnel 3 with this unit, which has all that technology, there's no comparison. This thing beats it out because they knew they had a winner and yet all of us make mistakes. But here's the thing, you cannot go wrong with the Wind Tunnel High Performance Vacuum. They sell it on Amazon. They sell it at Walmart right now and Target and those kind of stores. And again, sometimes you can get them from 200 to 179 to 149 if they're on sale, like a Black Friday sale. But I, I just don't think you're going to be disappointed with this vacuum in the long haul, especially with a five-year warranty. And they do stand behind their product. Hey, hope this helped you out. Please give, give me a th thumbs up if you like this review. Peace. <laughs>